Hi, I'm Mrs. Mitchell, and I'm here today to continue the discussion about fairness. You'll notice that I wore my um shirt. It is um not sure you, the element of indecision. Sometimes when you are undecided as to whether or not you want to be fair or unfair, you can wind up having issues. So I'm here today to talk to you about fairness. And I want to talk to you about being fair to yourself. Sometimes you probably think, I should do this, I should not do this. Um, sometimes it, you may even feel like there are two different people inside of you. So let's talk about what it means being fair to yourself. Um, if you want to be fair to yourself, um, that means doing your best at home, at school, everywhere you go. The unfair part of you, the other side of the story, is when you just decide, I'll do good enough to just get by. Okay. The other thing about being the fair part of you is not putting yourself in bad situations. You know when it's not a good fit or when something is going on that you really don't want to get involved in. Um, that's the fair side, getting yourself out of that situation. Unfair. Unfair, you goes, it's going to be okay. It's fine. Um, I, I don't think this is such a big deal, but you know really in your heart that it is, and you get that struggle. So to be fair to yourself, again, it means taking on challenges, okay? Um, don't just slink away from things when you think, whoa, that's going to be a little bit difficult. Um, unfair you goes, oh, that's too hard for me. I don't want to bother. I don't think I can do that. Where fair you goes, hmm, I think I can. Fair you realizes that um, sometimes things aren't going to work out. You may do your best. You may try your hardest. You may not make the team or you may not get something that you want. Um, be fair with yourself. Realize that nobody's perfect, okay, and nobody's going to be able to do everything. Okay, unfair you goes, I'm so stupid. I can't believe I didn't do that. I may didn't make the shot, whatever it is. Don't beat yourself up about it. It doesn't do you any good. Okay, fair you. Um, not procrastinating. This is a big one, especially when it comes to schoolwork. Okay, I'm not going to procrastinate. I'm going to get it done. I'm going to stay on top of it. Unfair you goes, you know what? I'll do it tomorrow. It'll be okay. I'll get it done. And then when you get to the crunch point, it's not there. Okay, so don't procrastinate. Be fair with yourself. Um, the other part about being fair, realize when you need help and you have a problem. Um, everybody does need help from time to time. Everybody's going to get to a part where they go, I don't get this. I don't understand. I'm in over my head. I need to ask for help. Okay. Unfair you goes, this is not a big deal. I can take care of this. Somehow I can get through this. Okay. Realize sometimes you can't. You need to ask for help. Okay. Fair you. Um, realizing or admitting when you did something wrong and you messed up. And take responsibility for your actions. Say, wow, I shouldn't have done that. I know it. I'm sorry. I won't do it again. Unfair you says, oh, it's not my fault. It just happened. I don't, you know, it, it, it wasn't really my responsibility. Take responsibility. The last thing, be yourself. Do what's right. Be fair to yourself. Okay. If something isn't feeling right or you know that your friends are expecting something from you, okay, then you need to remember, this is what I think my friends want me to do and I should do this or whatever. That's, that's unfair. It's unfair to yourself. When you're fair with yourself, now I'm sitting right in the middle. When you're fair with yourself, you mentally and physically feel better. Your um curium, okay, goes away. You can grow, you can accomplish things, and you'll know that you have control of yourself and your future. Remember, be fair to yourself, not unfair. It's never a good feeling, and it's not an answer. So remember, avoid umsurium. This is the element of indecision, by the way. Okay, and be fair to yourself. Thank you, Mrs. Mitchell.